Where did your name come from? Um, oh, that's a long story. Is it? Yeah, a little bit. It is. So it's the name of a of a character from this anime that I watched when I was a kid called Naruto, and he was just this background character named Genma that I always thought was very cool, and so then me and Connor ended up having like a joke about it, and then it very quickly became not a joke, and here we are. What one thing, if you could, would you change in the music industry? Ooh, subsidize um, or subsidize payments for artists. I think that's the right word. Uh, yeah. So like having a bit of support for those of us who want to be professional artists or are like semi-professionals at the moment and, and such, like myself. So it would be really nice to have kind of a bit of help so that we can work on creative projects and kind of get the ball rolling as, as more professionals. Streaming royalties, the money you get for streams could be a lot more. Yeah, for sure. Play more f Irish female artists on the radio. Um, I think it was, Real. For, forgive me if the statistics are wrong, but I think it was 3% of the top 100 songs played on the radio in 2023 were by women. So it would be nice to see more opportunities. It's hard enough already to get radio play, as we all know. Mm. So, you know, more opportunities for, you know, female artists would be nice. What was your first song that you wrote together? I mean, it was Dancing with the Lights song. We don't even play that one anymore. I wouldn't. Yeah, I, yeah. Would, I would say as a, as a band, it was How Bad, though. That was the first one we arranged together as a group. Like, and got it all, like, yeah. down together was, was that one. I definitely think that How Bad, like, it was fitting to release it as the first single as well because mm -hmm. it, was, it was the first song that we sort of resonated with, like, thematically, you know, as well. Like, it, it, it kind of had a message behind it that we were all, like, back and behind you know. what's your favorite venue to play in the grand social yeah grand social, yeah, grand social. Or, or wheelands i like wheelands any up and coming bands that you would recommend there's a few bands we went to college with that we're quite big fans of like uh search results who just put their album out last year and uh cable they just threw out an ep they're both absolutely fantastic i'm such a big fan of both of those acts uh, what about you? Um, yeah, no, I think Cable is a stellar one. Nerves. They're, uh, yeah, they're, they're great. They're prepping to release an EP now themselves as well, and they have a fantastic... Just yeah, there's so, there's so much great Irish music at the moment. Writing songs. Jam or plan? Jam. 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 Studio or live? Live. Live. Studio. Yeah, studio. Split. Split in the couch. Yeah. 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 <laughs> in ears or stage monitor? Yeah. This is yeah. This we, is we know we know what this split is. Yeah. yeah. I like I like ears. Yeah. Same. I go best for the stage monitor. Best of both worlds. Yeah, in, in ears for me. Yeah. yeah. Look, I'm I'm every Santex favorite member. <laughs> <laughs> the one who doesn't wear ear protection. Dream collaboration as a band. Queens of Stone Age. Ooh. The Beths. Gilliband. Solid. Slow Dive. Solid. Ooh. All of them at the same time. Favorite chipper? Uh, Casey's in Cork. An Angelo's in Seabury. That's none of you who know that one. <laughs> McInnesis. The Valley in Navin. Okay, and now we have a question from Liliana who was our featured artist in episode 3 of series 1 and her question is Hiya, it's Liliana Now, we all know how hard the music industry can be so my question for you is what's the best advice you've ever received? Play live and play live a lot That's probably the best advice I ever got Comparison is the theft of joy Oof, that's good Damn. Uh, it's basic, but practice. Just practice. That's all. The more you do it, the better you get. More is more. More is more. <laughs> Fair. Where can we find Gemma online? You can find us on Instagram uh, at, at Genma underscore band, and that's G E N M A. And then you can get us on Spotify. We've got a single out 
Uh, that's also on Apple Music and Deezer and stuff as well. It's on everything. Yeah, yeah. it's on everything, so you can find us there. And uh, yeah, we have a website too. If anyone wants to check that out, it's just gammaband.com. And what's next for Gamma? So we're trying to go back to the studio now. Let's get another either... We're still in the means of like uh, pre prone everything out, but we're looking to get back in the stew and either do a single or an EP in the very near future. So hopefully you'll be seeing a lot of us now coming into the summertime. to 